Hey YouTube, what's going on? Okay, so I wanted to come on real quick and talk to you about um, something that I saw somewhere. I'm not gonna say where. Um, so what I saw was insulin bottles not being dated. This is a big deal. I talked about it on um, another video, get your med cart up to code. I'll try and um, link it above at some point. Um, but yeah, like when you receive insulin from the pharmacy and you, they, they deliver it on ice cause it has to be refrigerated until it's open. Once it's open, it can be in the cart for 28 days. So you, once you pop that top off the vial and you take it out the fridge, you pop that top off the vial, you have to put the date that you open it so that you know when to throw that insulin out so you can order it a couple days earlier okay so I just want y'all to keep that in mind because we cannot as nurses be giving out expired insulin like and I've seen this on all so many carts and I'm just like what the heck like First off, the nurses might not know. Second off, why is pharmacy not like putting the pressure on these facilities to educate their nurses to just date your insulin? Like they're only good for 28 days. Lancers, they're good for I think 40 something days. Um, now, if you open the insulin and put it back in the fridge, I don't know how long it would ask. You would have to ask pharmacy on that. Now, if you're on a car and you see that they're not, the vials aren't dated, the, the insulins aren't dated somewhere, then see when it was delivered. Cause it'll say the delivery date on the med itself. See when it's delivered. If it was delivered a couple days ago, you can pretty much guarantee that it was open within the last few days. So put a date on it. So at least you're in the ballpark of knowing when it was open and how long you're allowed to keep it. Like the same goes for eye drops. You cannot keep eye drops open in the car longer than 20 to 30 days. Like I forget the exact number. I always go by 30 just to keep it easy in my head. Insulin's 28, eye drops are 30, I think. I mean, you just have to keep ordering them every month, okay? Um, so if you have any questions, ask your nurse educator. Let me know if you have questions. But I just wanted to come on and say that real quick. Like, it's ridiculous. Like, we cannot do this. Like, date your insulin, guys. Um, was there something else I wanted to say? Um, no. I'm sorry I haven't been making videos, guys. I don't know if anybody even cares. Um, but I've just been busy with life, I guess. Like, I'm just in a weird spot right now. I'm between jobs. I'm all over the place with my kids because they're on um baseball team. So that keeps me super busy. Um, job hunting. Um... I could talk about that if you guys want. Um, I've been researching um, opening a staffing firm. So that's something I've been thinking about. Um, I got an LLC just to get the ball rolling. Just to like, in my head, it's real. I didn't apply for the EIN number. Um, I didn't go for the bank account yet. Like nothing like that. I just, um, I'm in the research phase. It's a lot of expenses to open, to launch a staffing firm. It's a lot of expenses. Um, I'm struggling right now with 1099ing people or W2ing people. Um, it's just so much to take into consideration, um, financially that I'm taking my time. I'm, I have to see on a daily basis what am I going to be doing and I'm not quitting my job like no I'm not quitting the launch no 
I'm gonna keep my job and do it on the side. And then once I surpass or equal my income, well, now I got some options. I can either double my, stay doubling my money or I could scale my business. Um, so I am sick of being an employee basically and that's it. Um, let me know what you guys think. Please don't forget about the insulin thing um date your insulin guys like it's just so crazy to me coming from where i was for like 17 years to seeing these other carts like as agency and and i'm working in other facilities it's just like wow okay so let me know if you have any questions um video requests i don't know i'll try and do them that's it guys i love you guys and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.